guys, welcome back to my second video of the week, Pregnancy Edition. Um, as you can tell from the title, this is going to be a basically a baby boy clothing haul. Um, just to give you guys some ideas, if you also are expecting a baby boy this summer or anytime soon, um, these are just a few things I've bought for him so far. I'm trying not to go overboard because I know um, many other moms have been telling me like, he doesn't need that many newborn outfits and things like that because they do outgrow um, the sizes really quick. So I just thought it would be fun to share what I've got him um, so far. Um, so just before I start, a quick note. Um, a few of these items have actually been gifted to me off my Amazon um, baby registry. Um, so if you're one of those people, once again, thank you so much for the super sweet gifts. Um, I just want to throw that out there that not everything in here is something I purchased, but I'll be sure to mention the things that I did purchase. Um, I think I'm going to start with the first thing, which is the most exciting. And as most of you know, um, I'm pretty extra. I'm, I'm probably like going to be that mom, um, clearly, because I'm really extra with my dog. Uh, he has like his own clothes and his different carriers and purses and things like that. So you can only imagine how much my baby boy is going to be spoiled. Um, so originally this was going to be his take home outfit. The size I think said newborn if I'm not mistaken when I ordered it. Um, well, uh, that was not the case. It arrived much bigger than newborn size. So unless I have a really, really, really big baby, he probably won't fit into this until he's like three months old, maybe two months old. Um, but I will obviously try it on him because this was supposed to be his take home outfit from the hospital, but it's basically like a really over the top, um, bedazzled, like fancy little king outfit with little, what are they called, like beads or studs or whatever. Um, it's like a whole set, so this is this would be the hat, which I found so, so cute. These outfits are getting really, really popular right now. They're like blowing up all over the internet. These are like the little non-scratch mittens for his little hands. Um, and then, of course, the best part ever is the onesie. Um, I don't know, because this isn't really thick, but it, I feel like the material is a bit thick for the summer. He is going to be born, ideally, in July, so I don't know how that will go. But like I said, we'll see. Um, he probably won't fit into it until he's like three months old anyway, unless he's a chunky monkey, which we won't know until he's born. Um, so that is his take home outfit which I purchased and I was like super excited that was like one of the first things I bought for him I think um I also got these uh what are they called the swaddle me original swaddles small to medium size zero to three months um not all newborn babies like being swaddled um that's like a known fact but some really do like it because if you can see from the photo um some babies when they're born, they love being swaddled because it kind of gives them the same feeling as they felt um, when they're when they were in the womb, um, because it's kind of like a tight hug. Um, these are super. I mean, I don't know. These look pretty big for a newborn. So once again, I don't know if he's gonna fit into these, but um, they're just like this, and they Velcro snap at the front right here, where there's like little teddy bear ears. So I thought that was super cute. Um, they look really long. I don't know if he's going to fit into them. It's all kind of like trial and error type thing. So we will see how that goes. I just got two of those because um, he might not even like being swaddled, you know. So because many people have told me their babies absolutely hated it. So if I do notice that he does like it and the sizes are working out, then I can always just order more off Amazon or something like that. Um, these are multi-use muslin swaddle blankets. These ones are actually from Sue. Um, super super sweet of her I had these on my registry and I thought they were super cute because of like the basic print um, they're really really soft um, I'm not gonna unwrap them I'm trying to keep everything like in its packaging until he's actually born well actually no I'm probably I'm gonna have to wash all of this before he's born but I'm trying to keep it in the best state possible before I actually use it so it says 70% bamboo and 30% organic cotton which is amazing and what's so cool about these there's different like patterns this one has like stars um these are like unisex so i'm sure they would work for both boy and girl but the really good thing about these is that it says uh it could be a nursing cover because i do plan on nursing if that works out um whenever baby is hungry and this would be really useful in public 
Um, it can be like a stroller blanket, a breastfeeding cover, um, a baby swaddle wrap, so kind of like these swaddles, but just without like the Velcro attachment, you'd have to do it yourself manually. Um, it can even be like a changing table cover if you're somewhere in public and you really need to like quickly change a diaper. You can just lay these down and make sure that baby has a clean spot to lay on. Um, it can even be a burping cloth, um, a pram cover, and a receiving blanket. So it has a lot, a lot of uses and they seem pretty large in size and I really, really like the pattern, especially like the last one has like little zebras on it. So that was really cute. This is one of my favorite things actually that was gifted. Um, to baby A. So once again, thank you Sue for that. Um, what else? Okay, so this was kind of like a really random buy, but we were out shopping for him and um, he is going to be born in July, but when he's about three months old, I feel like the weather is going to start to get a bit cooler um, as it is going to be fall. So, um, and obviously he's going to dress just like his dad. So this is literally like something Ala would wear. So we saw this and like fell in love with it. Uh, I think it's a size 3 to 6 months, right? So this is not newborn. Um, I do want to mention um, a tip I've been given by almost everybody is do not focus on one size. Like, So I've been getting variety, right? So I don't just focus on buying newborn. I think he has about like 7 to 8 newborn outfits. And then it moves on to 0 to 3 months. Uh, and then 3 to 6 is what I've started getting now. Um, like I said, it's nothing major. It's a really small collection because I, I still have four months to go. But this is just what I've started getting so far. So this is like a cute little fancy button up. I think he'll fit into this in around like the fall time. Hopefully. I mean, we'll see. We, we won't know until he's here. Um, and then for the like when it starts to get a bit chillier, obviously there's not like a winter jacket. I know that. Um, just kind of when the weather starts to get a little windy and coolish, we got him like this little... <laughs> gray jacket i feel like gray is gonna be something he wears a lot because i love like we really both like neutral colors so we focused on that a lot so that's just like a little jacket for when it gets colder um another thing okay these were gifted from yeah from auntie michelle these are also off the um baby registry and these are probably like the most purest accurate newborn size that I've seen so far um, these are like so so tiny and I can't believe he's gonna be this small and it sucks because I've been told they don't really fit into the size for long so I'm gonna try and like enjoy it as much as I can these are just this was like a three pack from Carter's that Auntie Michelle got baby A um, I think my favorite is this one it's so cute it says dad thinks he's in charge that's so cute <laughs> So, um, like I said, I'm really into, like, well, both me and my husband are really into, like, the whole neutral vibe. There are some really nice pops of colors in here, you guys will see. Um, these, Ala got for him, and these are so, so cute. I think even, like, for an outing or, like, bedtime or anything like that, they're multi-use. So this is, like, um, they didn't come all together. Basically, you buy each part of the set by itself so this is a three pack of the hats zero to nine months which kind of confused me because I don't understand how something can be zero to nine months if anyone knows feel free to explain that in the comment section I'm pretty sure it goes newborn zero to three three to six and so on but um I don't know but anyway it's 100% cotton so it's really really soft um, and then it just comes with well it didn't come with but we bought the three pack matching leggings so that goes with each hat and then the onesies that matches <laughs> each pair of leggings and the hat. So I think these colors are, I mean, the typical baby boy colors and like they're stereotypical, but I mean, they're so cute. And these, what sizes are these ones? These say, okay, so these say newborn. This is a different brand. I'm not sure the name, um, but like you can note, as you can see, these are like, they look a bit bigger. So if you're comparing this newborn size okay um to this one there's like a pretty big difference so like i said it really varies from brand to brand i found that carter's is the most accurate size um and i mean he, if i do put this on him and he's really tiny he might just be swimming in it a little bit until he puts on that baby weight but i mean that's not that's not the biggest deal there's worse things in the i got him these are these the okay so this says it's a onesies brand 
These are newborn. Oh no, okay. Wait a minute. Okay, these are different sizes apparently. That's confusing. This one says three to six months. Same brand, onesies brand. And it looks like a newborn size. I don't know if that's a mistake on their end. Three to six months, I don't know. Maybe not. But it says I am the future and it's so cute. He has a lot of blue so far. So I've kind of like stopped buying blue because I do want to change. And then this is the same brand I bought them together, but this one says zero to three months. So this looks like newborn to me, you know what I mean? Like this is the exact same size as the card is newborn, but this says zero to three months. So I don't know. It's I guess every brand has its own sizes, but that's why it's good that I have like a ton of variety so that I can change him depending on newborn. They're just like the little, the cute bibs. Uh, this one says little man with like the, the lion on it. Um, he will use these eventually. I'm sure. I mentioned earlier that the blinged out uh, take home set was the first thing I bought. Actually, that was like the second thing I bought. I think the first thing we ever, ever bought, and we bought this before our announcement photo shoot, is this super cute uh, onesie brand again, zero to three months, which looks like a newborn size. And it says loved, and I love this. I even used this in one of the photos I posted. Um, I just think it's so cute. I love the basics, like anything basic, white with like a print on it. Um, these are not the ones you brand. This looks like newborn size to me. These are from Children's Place. Girl and my aunt, uh, or his wife. Um, I feel like Children's Place has really, really good material. One of the best I've seen so far. Um, it just says, I love my family. It's so cute. And then they also got the zero to three months. See, like this one looks bigger than the other one. Um, grandma, a professional spoiler. <laughs> Um, and then this is really cute. They got like this whole set. So you could, I could put like the, so this one with these leggings on top. It's like the footed ones. So these are good when the weather is a bit colder or chillier. Um, and then this cute, cute hat and this cozy also footed onesie, which like I said, children's place has the best baby clothes that I've seen so far. I really, really like their their clothing that was um, from them. So really, really like that. I believe Indigo Baby. Uh, the brand is Bella Tuno and it's like really, really bougie and expensive. Um, shout out to Auntie Amal. She got these for Baby A. These say zero to three months, but these look like, I mean, I don't know, like I said, it's my first baby, but these look like six month old outfits. They are huge. Now, I don't know how they're gonna look on camera, but they look really, really big. Um, these are so colorful and cute. And basically, it's uh, five days of the week. So like the weekdays. This one says, just another Manic Monday. Taco Tuesday, which is my absolute favorite one. I love this one. The color just reminds me of Taco Bell. I know. So funny. Happy Hump Day. And then Thirsty Thursday, which is funny. And the last one is Friday, which is the bright green one. So those are really, really cute. Those were gifted by Baby A's aunt, Amal. I think so far that's all of the clothing items. We got gifted a, um, what are they called? They're called a pack and play, right? That's what they're called. Like the actual name is like a pack and play. Um, they can safely nap in those and be in those if you're busy. Um, and we also got gifted the, like the, um, I forgot the brand. Ugh. One second, let me go grab it. So this is the, um, it's like blocking my face. Fisher Price um, Bounce and Play uh, chair. So I can just have him in this um, if I'm busy cooking or for him to be somewhere safe. Um, I think I'm going to use this specifically for the like newborn stage, like mostly. Um, when I need like to take a shower and I have nowhere to put him, then uh, he could just chill in this and be there and be in the washroom with me. Um... That way I know he's safe and he can't get into anything or hurt himself. Um, I know these aren't like the safest for napping um, to put him when I just want to get something done quickly. Um, I can keep him nearby and watch him and make sure that he's going to be safe. Um, the last thing, like I said, I'm going to be like the most extra mom. And this baby is going to be like, what is it? He's gonna like actually like using a pacifier. I'm praying that he does because I've heard it's a lifesaver. 
uh, when they're grouchy. Um, but I had this one custom made and I got two of the exact same ones. Um, that's just Leo crying in the background for my attention. Yep, that's what my life is. Um, I think he's sick of me filming. This is the custom blinged out baby pacifier that I had made for him. We're not announcing his name till birth. Many of you know that. If you do know the name, I'd appreciate if you didn't comment it. It's a secret. Um, but I had two of the exact same ones made. Um, just in case something happens to the first one. Hopefully he likes taking the pacifier. I guess we'll find out. Um, but like I said, I'm that type of mom, so... Um, I think that sums up, and now Leo has joined us, I think that sums up everything uh, that I've started to accumulate for him right now. I'm trying not to go overboard, but I think I have a good variety. Um, if you guys have any questions or you want to add something or suggest something, feel free to comment it down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!